Welcome to Portsmouth. How does it feel to have signed for the club? Yeah, no, it's nice to be. It's nice to be down here and have um, signed, signed the papers just earlier and, and can't wait to get started. It's obviously the club speaks for itself, the, the magnitude of the club, and um, I just really can't wait. Can't wait to get started and be a part of this club. Why is this the right move for you at this stage of your career? I think it's it's just an exciting exciting opportunity to, like I said, to sign at such such a big club with the proud history it's got, and um, hopefully we can, as, as a collective, we can really push this year and and um, give it a real go. Yeah. How did this move come about, and what have your conversations with John Messino been like? Yeah, no, it's it's um, it's. it's gone on for a, a, bit, a fair while now but yeah I'm happy to finally get it done and um, like I say really excited to to get it done and the um, conversations I've had have all been really positive everyone I've spoke to about Portsmouth has, has had really good things to say and um, yeah, it's just a really exciting point in my career. And you would have spoken to goalkeeping coach Joe Prodomo as well how have your chats with him but him being and how excited are you to Start yeah, me and Joe had a Zoom call, um, and he basically just put his his um, training methods down and the vision of the club and and how the club works really. And, and from that moment, it was sort of something I wanted to sort of explore and and really really couldn't um, couldn't fault anything that he's he said. How excited are you for sort of a fresh challenge and, and a new start as well? Yeah, really excited, really excited. It's obviously a nice. A nice place in the world, and um, that also helps when 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 you're coming down and and moving away and and coming down here. It's 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 nice that it's a nice place, and there seems plenty to do. I had a little walk around Portsmouth last night, and it, it seems it seems a nice area. Let's talk about you as a player. What would you say are your best goalkeeping attributes? Uh, shot stopping for me is is what 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 I'm probably probably best at, which is. At the end of the day, it's a, it's a goalkeeper's job keeping the ball out of the net. But no, I'm, uh, yeah. Um, but I'm always obviously looking to to improve, and hence why the conversations with Joe really stood out to me. On to your career today. You arrive here after leaving Huddersfield at the end of last season, a club where you're at since 2008. So, how would you assess your time there overall? Yeah, it's, it's, there's been plenty of up and downs at Huddersfield. I've, I've it's. Um, it's the club I grew up supporting, and, and it will always hold a hold a special place in my heart. And to to finally play for their first team a couple of years ago was a special special moment for me and my family. And, and then to end up playing thirty odd games or whatever it was for them was was really nice. Um, and then there's obviously been the loans here and there, which have have helped benefit my career so far. But it's just time for a change now, and and time to freshen things up. I think. Yeah, you alluded to it there. You had a number of loan spells during your time at Huddersfield. How crucial have they been for your development and what have you learnt on, on those spells? Not massively and they've all been at different different parts in my career as well. I mean, I've had a few early on uh, getting to know men's football and then I was I was fortunate enough to to, to, to play nearly a season at Huddersfield, um, which was which was really good. And then I've had a couple of loans afterwards as well to, to sort of back that back that up and I think it's all it's all been good experience and it's all it's all helped me helped me to progress. Yeah, you progressed through the England youth ranks too. How would you summarise the experiences you had on the various camps there as well? Yeah no it's just proud. Like it's just proud to to play for your country at any level I think and um albeit not the first team but it's proud to earn and caps for your country and um yeah it's just an honour really so um they were all all good times. And just finally, what are your personal aims for the season? Look, obviously there's a good there's a good goalkeeping group here. Obviously Will's Will signed earlier on in the in the window and obviously he showed last year what he can do and things, so I'm I'm looking forward to to getting to work and uh, with Will and Joe and and the other uh, younger keepers that are, that are here and, and sort of just, just push and, and be of assistance wherever I can and, and, and help the whole department out really.